That's my hookah. We gonna ignore that because um we can get it. Sitting on in my PJs or whatever. Ow, been my key to clear skin water. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be doing a review on this hair, this curly hair. Okay. Okay, do you see this? Do you see this? But before we get into the video, I do need to remind you guys that I post every Monday and Friday, so definitely be on the lookout for my videos and also turn on your post notification bell so you can get when my videos, you know, new videos are posted. Show me love. Like I feel like I had I got so much love when um I first started my YouTube channel, which was like what a year ago well i really started using it like last year so um you know i got a lot of love um if you see this review please subscribe please share and um comment below if you have questions so and also comment suggestions of what you want to see me post on my channel because i don't want to just post hair reviews and different things that you guys don't want to see i'm making videos for you and for myself too because i love making videos but I'm making it for you guys and I don't want to do boring videos like suggest fun videos that you know you guys want to see me do like interesting videos yeah that's it enough rambling let's get into the review so today I am wearing Vivi Baby's curly hair this is specifically their water wave textured hair okay they sent me four bundles of 26 inch water wave Brazilian hair and one 20 inch frontal 13 by 4 frontal the frontal did not come pre-plucked and the knots were not bleached i had to bleach the knots and i had to pluck the frontal so this is the um well let me show you a close-up of the frontal now that it is installed on my head and this is how the frontal looks like up close and this is the middle so you know i told you i bleached it after i bleached the knots i also tinted it um the tint is a little dark but it's okay you know i'm making it work or whatever and then this is the parting space so you know it's a really really far apart i don't know if you guys can really tell so yeah i wet the hair a little bit because i wanted y'all to see how it looks like when it's wet and obviously, you know, the hair is dry on the back. So, but this is how the hair just looks overall. I'm also going to be putting the price on the screen right here. I believe it's $260, but I'm going to put the exact price so you guys can see. Typically, I talk about the pros and the cons. But before I get into the pros and the cons, I just want to get, you know, the general questions out the way. You guys usually ask me how long have I been wearing the hair. I have been wearing this particular hair for a month. Literally a month. Um, within the month of wearing the hair, I've been washing it. I've been brushing it. I have been styling it. And I've been able to gather enough information to let you guys know exactly how good of a quality of hair this is so now that you guys know the length of the time that i've worn the hair we're going to talk about the pros okay number one pro the shipping the hair comes within one week during these hard times of covid it is very hard for us to get a company that's gonna send the hair out really really fast and i can assure you that this company will definitely send you your hair within a week okay because i received my hair within a week like literally talk to them that talk to them that week and like i want to say like four or five days later 
got my package. So you're gonna get your hair within a week. Aside from shipping being one of the pros, second pro is the hair is super, super affordable. I mean, come on, $260 for 26 inches? Four bundles and a frontal? That is an amazing deal. Just the cheapness alone is a huge pro. Another pro about this hair is it definitely holds up. It's been a month and it still looks really good. And I'm just gonna show you guys up close. The hair is basically 80% dry. We're done talking about the pros. Let's talk about the cons, okay? This is where you guys really need to listen so you know if you really wanna deal with this when you do purchase this hair. Number one con, the hair has shedding i have brushed and washed and styled the hair it sheds but this is curly hair curly hair is gonna shed whether you believe it or not it's gonna shed so the hair does shed another con is the hair is a little tangly i don't like that at all it's a little tangly um, when I brush through the hair, I do have little tangles. Like I said, it is curly hair. Um, so I expect a little tangling, but literally even as I'm talking right now, it's just a little bit of tangliness to it, which I don't like. My final con is that this hair is dry. Um, I had to like, look, look at it right now. You see that? So let me tell y'all what I do with cheap hair because it's very, very cheap. And I know you guys probably want long, beautiful 26 inch cheap hair and you want it to last you a long time. You want it to look like how it looks like when I'm wearing it. I'm gonna do a video on how I style, you know, cheap hair like this. But number one tip I can give y'all is this, water. And a spray bottle is your friend water in a spray bottle and mix it with leave-in hair conditioner and get you a good denim brush it's used i know I'm, i've just used it to do the video but denim brush leave-in conditioner with water spray it on your hair brush it through slowly until you get the curls to spring up your hair will look just like this but i can do a tutorial if you guys want me to on how i get my hair to look exactly like this all day comment below and i will do a tutorial because a lot of cheap hair it's it's gonna be hard to manage it's gonna not last you long if you don't take care of it properly and i've been meaning to do videos like that which i think i need to do it because i do get complaints y'all order the hair it's not what you expect and it depends on how you also take care of it especially with cheap hair you want it to last longer so you gotta take care of it better so i can definitely help y'all out with that um but i just gave you my tips on what i've done to keep the hair looking you know fresh and everything so yeah um, the, the bit of mattedness to it, dryness, shedding, I mean, it comes with um, inexpensive hair. Um, you know, this is literally typically always the problem with inexpensive hair. So you're going to kind of have to like decide, do you want to deal with the pros that it's going to look really good um, within the first few months, but it might not last as long but if you really maintain it it could last you up to a year or do you want hair that's not that high maintenance but it's expensive but it's gonna last longer and you don't have to do too much so um you know we are living like we're literally in a pandemic and honestly I would go with the cheap route because you know we gotta save money and i will put in that extra work just to save some money so you know yeah so oh also let me pull all the hair so you guys can see how it all looks and also i'm five four and this is where the hair stops it stops right here like literally 
by my breast area and this is 26 inches but you know as you pull it it's longer obviously but it's curly hair um so yeah you know i hope you guys hope you enjoyed the video and um definitely comment below if you do order the hair and you have any questions let me know in the comment section below um i appreciate you guys for watching and supporting me and i will see you on my next video i'm talking really low because it is so late and your girl about to go to sleep i hope you enjoyed the video and i will see you guys next time bye